Welcome back to Digital Card Battle! And, if, uh, and quite frankly, even though it's still sto it's, it's still storming outside, isn't it? No, it's actually kind of quiet right now. Well, at least Ohio is safe. Yes. Yeah, in case you didn't know people, Hurricane Sandy. Yeah. I, I, I know some people who are living in the eastern coast, so I hope they're okay. Yes. Everybody be safe. And please don't be reckless. Oh, yeah. We... Our one friend is at a fort where one of the hurricanes was at, and we texted him going, Don't do anything stupid! Follow your orders! <laughs> do not sneak out, you idiot! Mm hmm Which he probably would. Yeah. In the meantime, let's move on to something more lighthearted. Yes. Such as Gotham Bob Wallpaper! Yay! And on to Pyramid City. Are, yay, yay, yay. Are we going to run into magic carpets around here? Magic Oh no, we're going to run into DK, Anjuman, and you again. Oh, fun. Yes. In fact, she has a card in this game. Joy. In fact, it's a, a special fusion, actually. Um, I forget which fusion it is. Um, I'm wait Yeah, he may show up. Great. I, 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 I forget the fusion because uh, I just fused her. He uses the powerful Darkness Wave deck. And it is very powerful, actually. You'll see in part 10. Nice. You are only hope. Huh? Train yourself. Become stronger. There should be another fusion shop here. I spent about five minutes in that fusion shop, so you've been warned, folks. Yes. I'm counting on you. I look forward to seeing you again. Wait! And TK! Hey, uh, hello, Doug Erholtz. A, otherwise, a, also known as, you know, Squall. In, um, yes. In both Dissidia and in Kingdom Hearts 2. Yes. I think he'd be, I think uh, Doug Hurls was a decent squall in uh, Kingdom Hearts 2. Yes, he was. I think it was slightly better than uh, David Boreanaz. <laughs> Wiseman Tower, huh? Interesting. And Anjaman. Can you believe that the Adventure and Adventure 2 lasted for about 50 plus episodes each? If I remember correctly, uh, 50 episodes for Adventure 2, 54 episodes for Adventure. I think <laughs> that's the case. Nice. Anyway, time for the battle arena. Our first opponent, Centauromon. Uh, yep, 3-3-2 three, three, and deck color red. I am Centauromon, the guardian of this arena. I cannot let you pass. Your journey stops here. Gain a fire deck. This deck is tough against blue. Would be a problem if I had a blue deck, which I don't. I dare you to break through my defense. <laughs> um, is that an invitation? Uh, in that case, I gladly accept. Fire for fire. And we got the first turn. Oh, and we can Digivolve right off the bat! <laughs> Speed Digivolve into... Tyranimon! Who, oddly enough, is the second opponent in this arena. Yeah, your first two opponents specialize in fire decks, but... And then you got Anjumon with an all-nature deck. Yes. Anyway, first opening volley! Yee! Yeah. Ooh, Meteormon counter. So, opponent gets first dibs on attacking. <laughs> yeah, the Pedomon card that he drew. Again, to remind folks, 
Pedamon pretty much uh, increases your circle damage by your HP. Or at least. Yes. <laughs> do, 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 do. And 30 HP left for Deal Tamamon. Are you, sure, are you just gonna say yes for the entire commentary? You sound so like uh, Beast Wars Megatron. <laughs> Uh, no David K, but uh, who can be? Uh, where's the fun in that? A little torment first. Yes. 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 <laughs> Coral charm in play. Let's go for an all nothing gamble. Up. And Beamon for the counter. Beamon. So thus, first win goes to Tyrannomon. <laughs> you know, seriously, I wish I could find Digimon World 2. I mean, that is a real fun game to play. Now, I wouldn't play Digimon World 1 very much because since it, it's kind of like a sim, it's the sims kind of, you know, we had to actually train you. Yeah. I'm not so sure if I would enjoy that. Anyway. Yeah. Next Digimon is Candlemon. And, yeah, I think I'm going for a Dino Kick, but fortunately, Candlemon has a trick up its sleeve. Centaromon. Mm. Sure. Change and plus 400 attack. More than enough to knock out Tyrannomon. Do 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 do. Flame Bomber! And, and yes, Candlemon is a, a recruitable Digimon in Digimon World 2. <laughs> in case of Digimon World 3, it's more or less the uh, your typical starter Digimon. Mm. Uh, yeah, along with some new Digimon. And yes, the Season 3. The Tamers Digimon are recruitable too. <laughs> but I think the, the definitely the weakest entry is indeed Digimon World 4. Considering it doesn't play like any of the other games. Ah. I mean, I remember seeing a, a review of that game. I was like, this ain't Digimon World. It's more like a dungeon crawler with uh, Digimon using weapons and stuff. <laughs> it's it's like a more generic dungeon crawler. Sure, Digimon World 2 was a dungeon crawler, but at least it was more unique. Yes. Well, how would you know? You never played it. Yeah. But if you Sounds ever, about right to me. But if you ever get a chance, you should play it. <coughs> Partner win. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. And another Candlemon. Why do I get a feeling it's going to use a, a Coral Charm? Uh, oh! You're not going to use a Coral Charm to defend yourself. Not very smart. You just threw away the win, you know. <laughs> what can I say? The AI can be stupid sometimes. Especially those who tend to just go for all the, the same attacks over and over. I don't know what. I, maybe they're just some of them are just hard set on just knocking you out in one strike. That could be the case. Anyway, Sitaramon is beat. We win. <laughs> Eleven experience points and Gatamon got a got a booster equipped. Rockmon and Thundermon as new cards. Eh, I'll use them as fusion fodder. <laughs> you know, maybe in the future, maybe I should do the other two starter packs as Hawkmon or Armadillomon. <laughs> I don't know, but that technically I prefer using Vmon's deck. Tyrannomon's our next opponent. 
weak at weaker attack power, but decent defense and digivolve speed. And he uses fire and nature. Paleo energy deck. This is a rough, but well battled <laughs> deck. <laughs> Are you laughing at tags? <laughs> Someone posted something and I had to look at it. Now I have to respond. Fair enough. Oh, dear gosh, and I know exactly how I'm going to respond with this, too, and it's horrible. Yeah, <laughs> and folks, if you can't hear me when she's typing, blame Skype for that. Yeah, I tried to... I wonder if it stayed. Yeah. I'm starting to wonder if it was my microphone on my uh, computer, and I disabled it, so... Either that, or it could be my um, microphone settings itself on Skype, because I had it set to auto-adjust. Right. That could be the case. Well, we'll I'll give this recording a look-see, and if it turns out to be bad, I'll just re-record. Yep. First attack and set. I'm going to try to lean as far away from it as possible. Anyway, first opening exchange, Tyranimon versus Beomon. First attack goes to Beomon, Turbo Pecker. Peck, peck, peck. Tyranimon with Blaze Blast. Beomon is knocked out. First win goes to, well, the guy in the blue corner. Since I'm always, since I always tend to be blue right here. I right, well, you know, it's just like in. Uh, Digimon, the, the, in Pokemon Battle Revolution, actually, it, when you're the, when you're player one, you're always in the blue corner. Hmm. Interesting. All right, I'm gonna use a support card, and it is a failure. Fail. And my phone's on the other side of the room, so no fail horn. <laughs> yeah, the soundboard <laughs> might be. Soundboard might get rather annoying. Yeah, so I'm done with that for a little while. At the very least. Dino Kick. Blaze Blast for the counter attack. Down to 290. Man, we got a mirror match for sure. But unfortunately, looks like the red corner's Tyranimon is about to faint first. And I'm... Uh, and unfortunately, I can't use that recovery floppy. So I have to discard. Uh, yeah, I'll save this in case I have Vmon as a backup. Blaze Blast. Most likely. And Tyranimon is not using the premium stake. Interesting. I, I don't... <laughs> he just lost another premium stake. The thing is, the premium stake, it heals your HP by 500, and it heals the opponent's HP by 200. Dang it, one. So, it's a rather useful card, actually. Sure, it'll heal your opponent a little bit, but... Meh. Tyranimon, from the blue corner, wins again! Yay! And last up for Tyranimon is... Muchomon. Huh? Oh, trust me, you... Oh, I, I found it good. Okay. I have to show GM this eventually, just to see his expression. Okay. Or at and least to hear his reaction, because it's funny. Uh -huh. And still no premium stake usage from Tyranimon! I would've figured he would've used those stakes to, you know, spare himself. That way he would last longer on the battlefield. Unfortunately, knockout for Tyranimon. Could this be the uh, three, could, could this be the red corner strategy? Possibly. But it's not gonna work because we have Flangermon out in the field now. And 
let's see, Buchamon's strategy is not using a stake. This battle was over already. <laughs> He's going for a counter attack. A cross counter. And let's remember, folks, Flagermon's cross counter is actually a circle counter. <laughs> Which means he has zero cross attack points. It's short, a useless counter attack from the from the from the opponent. Flangerbond wins. <laughs> Partner win. Three to one. Adam wins. <laughs> Ten experience points. Bleh, hyper pack. It, yep, Gatabon is equipped with that bo experience booster. Ten percent experience boost. So she'll get a little bit extra experience, more than Vmon will. Yes. But don't ever give up. I know you can do it. Don't ever give up. Last match, Anjaman. Hello, Anjaman. Hello. If I remember... <laughs> I just more power use I do in TK. My mission is to seize your powers for real. I've been in there for many card arena for many card damage. I will defeat you. Prepare to meet my challenge. Evil Slayer deck. A deck that destroys darkness. So, darkness cards are no good here. Yes. Despite, despite the obvious edge they have against uh, nature cards... And now, versus Anjaman. And we get the first turn. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what we got. Are we going to play Gataman? No. We are going to play Agamon, though. Ah, I see what my strategy was. I'm, I'm going to go for a Warp Digivolve in my next turn. Nice. And next up, we ha first up for Anjaman is a Salamon. Salamon! Obviously, he pre predominantly uses his own evolution family as well as Gatomon's. Yes. Here we go! Mm-hmm. Do do. All right. First attack. Petite punch. Petite punch. Pepper breath from Agamon. Yeah, I, I yeah, I was right. Uh, Anjaman in the animation in the, in, the, in the anime. Is voiced by Dave Mallow, who I believe voiced is the current voice of Akuma. Interesting. That's kind of scary, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, Warp Digivolve. Whee! Do do do. All right. What's what will Meteor Mods Park card be? It is. Sataramon. Here we go. Meteor Mod with the easy first win. <laughs> and winner is Meteor Mon. <laughs> it's kind of it's weird that uh, Anjaman, as a champion Digimon, was able is able to hold all hold his own against certain ultimates. No, most notably against virus ultimates. Yeah, his primary attack, the Hand of Fate, very effective against virus Digimon. Even Myotismon had been able to dissipate it, although the attack itself was an ambush. 
Not much he completely destroyed Phantomon. Ouch! With a single hand of fate. Uh, interestingly, the only Digimon that Anjumon has never been able to defeat were those of the Mega Level, namely the Dark Masters and Venomiotis Mon. Mm. Although he was able to hold up Piedmon for a few minutes. Right. Hmm. Hey, wait. Uh, looks like, uh... Looks like Anjuman is gonna go down to the next hit. And note that, uh, card right there. In his, in his hand. The Patch of Love. If the opponent is Nature or Darkness, attack power drops to zero. <laughs> and note, I, I should note, in uh, Adventure 2, when uh, the Control Spire Digimon appeared, Anjumon's attack was more or less uh, useless. <sighs> yes? Oh, just laughing at a reply. I just had a. F I'm really mean. Uh huh. As. A, as, a, as a, okay. okay. Calm down. Calm down. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, you know, Control Spire Digimon. You know, you know, you realize that they were, were not, they weren't real Digimon. Therefore, Anjumon's attack was useless against them. Therefore, yes. therefore, in Adventure Two, his primary form was Pegasus Mon. Until DNA Digivolution came around. Hmm. Alright, and pat him out with the first hit! But not enough! Big Bang Blow! BAM! <laughs> Dead. Well, more or less deleted. Or reformatted, whatever you want. <laughs> anyway, clean sweep! And Gatamon and Vimon level up. Two new Digi parts have been added. Wow. Uh huh. Alright then, let's see what Anjuma gives us for beating the battle arena. I'll be waiting. The paths go to Sky City. You got a You got a green pack. Cool. Kamutemon. And we got a Pixiemon card. Sweet. All right. Do 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 do. Now then, now the fusion shop is open. Yes. And I spent about five minutes here, so make a sandwich. Speaking of which, I'm trying. I'm trying to cook some uh, chicken burgers, kind of. I just waited for them to thaw out. Ah. Anyway, next up in Sky City will be, uh, well, well again, Sky City will be facing off against Gatomon. It still amazes me that uh, whenever she de digivolves, she, she, she's actually the, she's perhaps the only uh, champion level Digimon of the Digidestined to actually digivolve to an armor Digimon. Because despite losing her tail ring, she's still classified as a champion level. Yes. Not to mention that as a sal as a Salamon, she does she's not stoned very often as a Salamon. <laughs> yeah, she's very rarely in her rookie form. Mm-hmm. Whoops. Uh, the... mm hmm. So, yeah, not much happening here. Uh, 
Do you want to fuse these two cards? What do we make out of this? Okay. Alright, yeah, yeah. I'm there's not much here. If you want if you want folks, you can skip ahead to part seven once I upload yep. it. Yep, we're just kinda here fusing. Oh, apparently, uh mm -hmm. Patamon has three official um digi eggs. Interesting. There's Pegasus Mon. Of the Digi Egg of Hope, right? Bar Baron Mon, the Digi Egg of Courage, and Mambo Mon, the Digi Egg of Light. I don't think we ever see Mambo Mon, but we do see Baron Mon in Digimon Frontier. I would say something, but it's obscure, so no. Okay. Oh shoot! At least it's not Hulamon, or else I'd make a Lion King reference. What the? Wait a minute. Huh? I'm just uh. Oh yeah, Mama Mon was actually in um an audio CD, an audio drama CD. That's probably why. That's probably it. Do 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 do. Hey who? Uh. Uh. Not much dog. What do you get? It's fusion. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go check those those patties. See how they're doing. Uh, All right, it is. If you want, fill a bit on random stuff. If you can. Toho Gungam style. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's real. It's real. It is really, really stupid. I'm going to send that link. Because, lol. <clears throat> nope, they're still not thought out enough. Ah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why are you la- What are you laughing about? <laughs> I don't know, really. <laughs> I just think my link is funny. Okay. Especially if you know the Toho fandom. <laughs> it's just, wait, what? I know by the end of that, I was sitting there going, what the hell am I watching? Hmm. But it is funny. Especially that in a role play, somebody is, was going, oh, let's have Sinead do the Gungam style dance to attract faith. No, no, and no. My inner Marissa jumped and went, yes, show them the video, and I will laugh. It'll be funny. Hmm. Mm hmm. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Well, not much to say, except, uh, in part seven, we'll finally, we'll go, we're going to Sky City. Yay! And we actually get, uh, we actually get the chance to not only fight Galtamon, I know I'm repeating myself. God, not only if I got to Bob, but we also get to see another familiar face from Adventure. Yay! Uh, don't, don't worry, I'm just looking up stuff. Hi. No. Okay. It's stuck in my head! What is? That stupid song! 
Uh huh. But yeah, whenever uh, <clears throat> well, yeah, whatever um, se whatever Selfiemon, which is the DNA digivolution of a Queenlemon and uh, Gatamon, whenever they yeah. digivolve, you, you see Salamon. Nice. Anyway, just a few, just a few more updates, and uh... <laughs> all right. Okay, now it's time to save. I'm sorry if I saw the board near the end, folks. <laughs> mm. Well, we've tried this how many times now? I uh -huh. I forget. Anyway, see you guys next time for uh, Sky City. See ya! Meow. Meow.